everyone. Welcome to Pearl's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make almond, ginger and pineapple trifle. It's very easy to make, it's absolutely delicious but I always make my homemade custard. It's just as easy as a packet, but it's tastier. So the ingredients for the custard, what I need is in the saucepan, I've got 500 mils of whole cream milk and 200 mils of double cream. And in here, so I put that on. So you need the milk to be very hot, but not boiling. Okay, so while that's on, in here, I've got five egg yolks and now I'm going to add stuff to it so five egg yolks and here I've got 100 grams of sugar so that you put in here got two tablespoons of corn flour so that goes in here and some say a teaspoonful of vanilla essence and now you start to whisk this and for at least four to five minutes still it's I'll show you how it goes keep whisking it to four to five minutes till it becomes absolutely like a clear color see now that's had at least four minutes of whipping and now the the color has to become nice and pale color and the milk is quite hot now. So now at this point, you take the milk and add some of the milk into this whisking all the time. Just a little bit, keep whisking. Okay, now at this point, you add all the ground almonds. That's 100 grams of ground almonds. Keep whisking. Okay, add some more milk in it. Still keep whisking. don't want any lumps in your custard okay now pour all this back into the milk and keep whisking don't let it get caught slowly keep putting it all in Stop stirring it, it'll start to burn at the bottom. So keep the keep the flame on a very low heat and keep whisking. This will take at least five minutes till you you know that the, it's starting to form like a thick custard. See the custard has had its four minutes now. You can see it's getting nice and thick. I haven't moved from here, I haven't stopped stirring it either. Yeah, you can see it's coating the back of the spoon. So at this point, you put the gas off. And that's it. Now this goes in the fridge, rest, let it rest, let it cool down, and then I'll show you how to assemble the trifle. Okay, while the custard is still cooling in the fridge, I'm going to show you the rest of the ingredients that we need for this trifle. In this bowl, if you take a glass bowl, and then you can lay, I've got almond sponge fingers and you can lay them like around the bowl and in the middle. In India, if you don't have almond cake or almond sponge, you could use almond biscuits. Okay, so that's approximately 10 slices of that. And we'll need sherry to soak the uh, almond slices. And over here I've got 50 grams of crystallized ginger uh, chopped 
and here I've got 100 ml of ginger nut biscuits. I put it in the blender and it's like breadcrumbs and some are big pieces so it should be like that. And I've got 250 grams of pineapple in chunks and here for the cream I've got I've got one pint of double cream and that will whip with some almond essence and here these are for the decorations I need some almond split almonds some more crystallized ginger and finely chopped pineapple so before we do anything else we need to put the sherry into this almond slices just pour the sherry over it depends on how, sh how strong you want it yeah, I put around 50 mils of it so now this you need to let it rest for at least five minutes and then we'll assemble the slice so you see the almond slices the cake has soaked in all the sherry now so and these are for my friends in india who don't like alcohol or can't find sherry you could uh, use the juice of the pineapple to soak the sponge so while the, while we're still waiting for the custard we can whip up the cream so that's the cream the one pint of cream that i have here and we're going to put a tablespoon of uh, sugar into it around a teaspoon of almond essence and that's it and we're going to whip it till it forms peaks okay. so you see the it started to form peaks and uh, okay so that's the cream done and put aside and that's the custard out. Give it another whisk. And put that aside. And now we can start assembling the trifle. So now. Down. Okay. So now on top of the sponge, first thing you do is put some, sprinkle some crystallized, crystallized ginger. Of it. Put some pineapple chunks, some at the sides, some in the middle. So if it's in the side, it will show. Only put half because we'll, we're going to layer it a bit. And then start to put the custard okay. put all of the custard in there it's lovely you can smell the almonds in the custard biscuit crumbs and you put that on the custard in the corners so it shows the side of the bowl okay. then you put the rest of the pineapple again at the sides guests will say wow that is delicious okay put some more crystallized ginger
pineapple. and the ginger nut biscuit and and when you eat it then you will know how delicious this is so i hope you and your guests enjoy this trifle and look forward to follow me next week to see what we've got on the menu next week till then